Hello ladies and gentlemen, Commander Green here. Today in Total War Attilia on Medieval Kingdoms. Um, we're playing as the English versus the French in a pretty intense battle here. Something new here, different game. Um, we're going to have a quick look at battle what's going on here. So let's have a quick overview of my men before we actually get into battle here. I'm going to defend this position in France. We are in, um, just at the front we have my longbowman. The very famous English longbow. Um, as you probably all well know during the medieval times. British, or the English should I say, very well known for their longbowmen. Um, behind them we have some bill sergeants, basically just um, a lot of spearmen behind them, or pikes should I say, poem men should I say. Behind them we have a lot of foot knightly retain, so basically heavy, mi mi what is that? heavy melee infantry. Behind them we have the footmen at arms, and we have a lot of cavalry, we have some cav on the side here. I think we're about to go to the battle now. Yeah, we're almost engaged. Okay. We'll go through some units. And at the back here we've got some knights. Obviously we've got the king here in the middle. So we're going to hold out here. It uh, looks like they're going straight for my throat here, actually. Yep, yeah, the move. I'm going to move these guys back, these longbowmen. I've got some mounted melee cavalry on the left, as well as heavy billmen, which is very medium poem infantry, which can hold against these cav. I might have to readjust myself more. I'm going to have to do this quick. As it looks like I'm going to try and flank me here. I'm going to readjust my position. There we go. Got double time, double time. Oh, no, I'll hang him. Looks like the tree's on fire. Here we go, they're coming up to something now. Better move my uh, marches back. Oh, I already failed away, I wasn't concentrating. Right, let's move my uh, in quick. What I want to do is get all my longbowmen, which are here. I'm getting back. Right, they're pushing. Attempting to push through. I have moved my heavy billmen up a little bit. Right, we've got archers out on the sides. I've got some heavy cavalry here we can push over to these guys. New shot cavalry. Move them back. We are massively outnumbered by the French by... Actually, not by a lot of monastery. We've got some really, really elite men here. So what we're going to do is now we're going to put these guys in this formation and we're going to charge. We're going to hit these guys ASAP. We've got some... Um, my mounted men at arms here, these guys are absolutely ruthless. These will pierce this line absolutely tremendously. So, there we go. Look at that. Look, look, they're actually cowering while they've readjusted their positions. Look at that. Absolutely brutal. What we're going to do is now we'll pull these guys back out again and go again. I'm going to keep doing that until we absolutely annihilate these guys. So look, they've already retreated now as well. What are these guys anyway? Oh, they're peasants. Ah, oh, no wonder why. Oh, we've got some um, spears on the right there. We're holding our line absolutely fantastically. Problem here, we've got, looks like we've got some cavalry attacking my melee cavalry there. We're going to do a full assault again with our uh, English nobles. This is AI battle, guys. You know, I'm not, no one seems to be wanting to play medieval, medieval kingdoms at the moment, which kind of sucks. It seems we're really holding a line here. We've got a massive amount of French. And uh, their king, where is their king? Because we're never playing against their king here. He's probably sitting back somewhere. Here he is, he's everywhere over here, look. He's actually in the battle, he's in the thick of it, sitting behind him. It's probably this dude here, most likely behind it, and it's different to everyone else. He's in there somewhere, he could have the flag, this could be him, he the flag of almost. I don't know, can't see. Unless you've already killed him. Right there, cavalry's retreating away. We've got more men assaulting through here on the right. But I'm going to move all my cavalry back, back here. Oh, these guys are trying to flank my um, billmen here, which is not very wise as our peasants, but fair play to them. They're going to get annihilated now by my cavalry. Oh, we're going to go straight for their throat, we're going to go straight for the archers of the cav. I'm going to push this cav through as well. They're going to go straight for their archers. Peasant archers as well, because the French didn't have too great um, archers in the medieval times. This is mean the British had really good archers. I think they have. Um, the yeah, oh yeah, over here on the left hand side, which is a bit of a worry. We have. Looks like we've got some gunners, hand gunners. That's going to be an issue. What we're going to do is we're going to. We could just annihilate them, but we're actually going to send a heavy billman over there to double time and take them out. The cow will annihilate these archers. Here we go. Look at this. They totally took one of those guys out. Here comes the next bird of cav. Ramming through. Look at that! Just absolutely carnage. No chance for those guys down there. 
But we're still battling along our pike men at the front are still holding their ground. We've got a lot of men to fight through though. We can just literally end this battle now by just sending this cav around the back. I want to see if I can get my men, these guys, into battle. What we're going to do is we're going to pull our line back. Move the king back a little bit. I'm going to try something pretty cool. Try and get our melee men involved. Move our archers back as well. Our longbowmen, shall I say. Order is going to move the entire line back and allow our melee men to attack. Give them something to do. So it looks like we're running away, but we're not. Simply, we're just doing a tactical retreat. So we can push through with our melee men to get them involved. Look, they're just like, oh my god, there's a lot of guys on this side. I build men behind them now, which is really useful. We just want to get these guys double time over there. Let's come around here. And look. There goes the foot knights. Foot knightly, you should say, the kings. We're we'll always a lot of men here, which is not good. We're going to have to push these guys in now. There's a lot of guys on the side. What we're going to do is footmen at arms are going to come over here and get ready. Just in case they waver, which I don't think they will, but they do. Good. Let's do some morale boost over there. Right, let's just charge this cavalry through because these men are. Look, they're absolutely nine my footmen over there. Right, we're going to push them on there. We'll push these guys there. Push these guys into them. All in formation. Beautiful. See what's going on down here. In the thick of it. Still absolute carnage in the French and English. Absolute annoying at each other. Right, he's losing men somewhere. Here we go. Someone's wavering. Right in the middle. Uh, it's over this side here. Well, right, that's them. My men nine arms in. Men at arms go. These guys will sort them out, definitely. Okay, see how it's going with the cab. The cab are pushing these guys back. Uh, not too great if I'm honest with you there. Um, okay, well, our cavalry some reason stopped. Right there, running away. Enjoying that attack. Right, we've killed the English king. Beautiful. I've oh, got some cavalry there. Let's try and charge him. Um, we've got some melee cavalry to come over here as well, see if they can get involved. So that's going down there. It's fighting between the men at arms. It's looking good, we're looking good. The English are annihilating the French. There's a lot of French here. See how I mean, how I mean we are outnumbered. We're outnumbered, but we've got a bit more skill. Uh, we're more trained men. But it's the French are holding out in the middle here. Oh, we've got men wavering here now. They're starting to waver. When they start to go, they all start to go. Here we go, look. They're starting to waver. This side's completely dying out. Actually, no, we're, they're still doing pretty good on this side, I'm honest with you. I still got a group of men at arms not doing anything. We're gonna send these guys in now because we've been sitting there just taking some hits. Right, let's get these guys just to attack King. King's guards should I say. Right, we've got some men, some I don't know how these guys got here, these English kings. Uh the English knightly. How oh, they got that behind the line? They're probably following trying to chase someone. And they're gonna have some fun. Oh those guys are retreating out of here as well. They're not enjoying that. Okay, we're gonna send them around the back. Oh, it looks like we're, we're doing good now. Everyone's starting to retreat. We we'll get everyone to push through. That's it, man. That's it, man. Right. We've got our men at arms here in the charge. These guys here, because they're probably going to attack us. Here they go. They're coming down. We'll put them in the middle. We completely don't need more or less around these guys now. These guys are not going to last very long. Right, here we go. This units here is going to try and attack. We're going to send our men at arms in. Here we go, man. let's do this. I'll zoom in there. I don't know how to follow him. I should really learn to do that. Oh, here we go, look at this. Look at him. Oh, yes. Oh, flip it out. Where's he going? Oh, he tackled someone. Look. He's like, have some of that. <laughs> Good man. A rugby tackle. That guy's a, to the ground. Good form. Good form. Oh, here we go. These knights are going to absolutely demoralise these guys here. Look, they're already wavering. Oh, we've got men coming back to the battle. Um, I'm going to have to want to take these guys down. I want to guard my archers so I'm going to push those guys over there. Oh, what's going on over here? Let's move these guys back here. These men at arms will have no problem with these foot knightly retines. Okay, looks like we'll win. It looks like we've pretty much annihilated everyone. Um, we've got some shotgunners, handgunners over here. Oh, shotgunners. Oh, we've got an attack here. Here we go. They're coming straight in tight. Oh! That's it. Weapons up. Two 
units here, look, two little regiments, foot. So we've got where Stu's handgun is in an absolute night at the back of his men here if we're not careful. But luckily for me, I've got Cav coming in from all directions. <laughs> These guys are going to have a shit day in about 10 seconds. Here we go, look, they've noticed them now, they're like, oh shit. Here they go, look. <laughs> they're like, run! Are they actually retreated? Yeah, they are as well, look, they're flashing, like, no, oh no. This is going to be carnage. Here they come, here comes the English Knights. Comes the English Cavalry, here we go. Oh no, look at that. Oh, we won. Wow, beautiful. That was a bloody good battle. It turned out to be, they, they hanged out, they they kind of um, held out for quite a while, from honesty, over here in the middle. They held out longer than I thought they would have. That was a pretty decent battle. I'm going to try and find some multiplayer battles and that would make it more challenging than what it really was. We was outnumbered, but because of the fact that my men were more highly trained than the others, we kind of had a no-brainer was going to win. Plus, we're English, so we always win. We always win. That's the way it is. So that was a really good battle, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. I'm going to try and get another one out. And I'll see you next episode.